Greetings, my fellow gamers. It is I, Wraith King, bringing you news from beyond the mirror from the other world. And today, they have recently released Vanessa on Seven Nights, and uh, a lot of things were changed, and I will be going over those things a little bit later, uh, probably in my next King of the Arena video, because, uh, and I'm already pressing the wrong buttons, as you can see, they've changed a lot of things uh, as far as the layout is concerned, but I figured it out, kind of, and they recently released Vanessa, and Vanessa, believe it or not, is another knight. And I believe she is uh, the replacement for Delens. And I actually should have realized this sooner that when they add like an empty space like that, it means new characters. And by the way, they are adding a, uh, a new set of uh, special characters, as you can see over there. I, from what it, what I can see from that character list is there's only going to be one, uh, one, of, one person on that character list. And it might be um, Kalahan because that symbol looks quite familiar. But anyways, um, and, and Spike was not awakened. Instead, they uh, added a brand new character. Her name is Vanessa. Um, from what I know about her is she is kind of supportive. But I won't be the judge of that. I'm going to uh, let the computer tell you guys and gals what exactly she can do. Um, so, so much of what I know of her right now is just her name. So we're all kind of going into this kind of fresh. We all are kind of going in blind. So I'm going to let the AI translate it for me. AI, what does her first ability do? Her passive ability. Desert Mage reduces the defense of the entire sustainable enemy army by 60% in addition. You receive 4 damage per month for all damage immunity and you receive only 30% of your maximum health every time you attack. Well, that's a different one. I've never heard of anything like that before. I mean, I know she reduces um, defense by 60%, which is great, but the rest I'm not entirely sure about. That's really weird. Uh, leave in the comments below if you know exactly what that does. But anyways, uh, computer, what does her first ability to do? Her first active skill. Sand Frenzy, reuse time, 75 sec enchantments cast 100% magical damage twice per second. In addition, the penetration effect is applied. After returning time, strength and sand craze will be switched to skill. Unfortunately, the sample menu does not uh, show footage of what the second ability is, the alternate version of her, um, her ability. It does not show. Uh, but don't worry. She was given to everyone for free today, which was crazy. I've never seen Netmarble do that before. And I will be showing you guys and gals what her, all of her abilities look like on adventure mode. I'm going to go to the harder difficulty too so we can really get a good look at it. But anyways, computer, what does this ability do? Her second active. Dehydrated Tsunami Reuse Time 90 sec enchantments inflict 80% magical damage to magic damage three times. In addition, increased skill reuse time by 20 seconds. After returning the time, it is converted to the more thirsty Tsunami. Wow, she has two abilities that swap to new ones, so she has a total of five different abilities. Unfortunately, um, it was kind of hard for the computer to translate what exactly the Awakening skill did, but don't fret, I know exactly what it does. What she does is she turns back time. So, all of your skills are reset, your characters are healed, um, I'm starting to believe that they may even be revived, but I'm going to demonstrate this in adventure mode to make sure my theory is correct that they do revive but including your awakening skills are also reset everything is reset so this legitimately turns back time but it does not affect your enemy team from what i believe so that's good too everything about this hero it says wow she was given to us for free amazing but enough of that, I want to see what her skills do. Let's go to adventure mode and test her out, shall we? You know what happened, my fellow gamers? The game crashed when I was reviewing this hero. Completely just crashed. But don't worry, I recorded footage of her first animations. Not the alternate ones, but I got her first animations, so at least you get to see those. But what's ticking me off, my fellow gamers, is that 
crashed and I had to uninstall the app, then I had to download it again, which means I have to download the update when it gets there, and I have to download all the resources from the game again, which takes long enough. But don't worry, to make up for this, I will upload this video early before anyone else does, like I promised. If you're new to my channel, what I normally do is I upload information about all of the heroes that the Korean version of Seven Nights release the day that the heroes are released. I translate them as soon as they're released, and the same is said for the global version. I review their heroes the day that they are released, and I will not go back on that promise. I did review this character, I translated what she did, but unfortunately I could not get all of her animations in. But to make up for this, I today will upload a King of the Arena video today showcasing this new character in the arena, level 30 in all, and I'm going to try to un unlock all of her slots so I can get her some strong items, some very strong items, and I'm going, not only am I going to do that, but I am also going to showcase the new build that I have for my death build team. I have Cauldron on my team at level 40, and he's very, very powerful. I want to demonstrate what exactly he can do in arena not only am i going to showcase him but i am going to showcase spike as well even if i lose and the ai does something completely stupid and my mage build is not complete so i am pretty sure i'm going to lose a lot in arena if i try putting her on my team with my mage build because it's not complete but regardless of that i am going to showcase all of these heroes and show you what exactly they can do today and I'm, that is a promise. I am going to upload that video today as soon as I possibly can, once the update is complete. But before then, I am going to upload this video so you guys can have something to watch while you wait. But anyways, that's all the time I have left for this review. What I have noticed so far from this hero is that she has the total of five different abilities. And on the character sheet, you can notice that she has been added to the seven knights list which means she is a completely new knight most likely to replace Delens after his treachery now this is something very very interesting that i have noticed in the seven knights lore if you know anything about this leave it in the comments below because i really do love the seven knights lore i love the story but unfortunately it is in korean i do not know what anyone is saying i don't know what's going on and i would really really appreciate it if you guys and gals could tell me what exactly is going on from what i know is she is a replacement for delens and she is um a very very powerful mage and that's obviously why they she's been added to the knights list and i should have expected this to be honest with you whenever there is an empty space on a hero list like this one that means that they are going to add a completely new hero. And I should have noticed this. But truth is, I didn't want to believe it myself because that means they would have to add another knight, which means eight knights. But now that I think about it, Delens betrayed the seven knight. With this treachery, he is no longer a seven knight, becoming a dark knight. So that made me think that they probably would come out with another knight, but I just didn't know when. And now that Vanessa is here, I guess that question was answered for me. And it just makes me like this game even more. The story is always changing, it's always twisting, there's always something interesting going on, and it just makes you love the game even more with every update. And I cannot wait for the rest of the knights to be awakened, because I guarantee you, they will be. All of them. Even Jai will be awakened. Unfortunately. On the bright side, I was wrong about him being awakened. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you weren't awakened, Jive, and you'll probably be the last to. <laughs> you weren't awakened. <laughs> yeah. Let's laugh at Jive in the comments, shall we? <laughs> he wasn't awakened. <laughs> but anyways, that's all the time. I wanted to review uh, the changes that they have made to the game. They made some serious game. Uh, changes and concerning the menu they have done a whole bunch with this update and I will review them as well once we um, the update is finished I will review uh, and try to go over what exactly they have changed as far as the menu is concerned because I know a lot of uh, English players are worried 
where is everything what what is all this and i'm pretty sure a lot of them are worried where everything is so don't worry i will go over that but right now i'll see you guys later and yes i will go over some of the some of the other updates as well i'll try my best to do everything i can to cover what exactly has been changed because i'm a little confused myself but on a side note don't you worry my fellow gamers i will upload the king of the arena video showcasing this hero and i will try to take a look at her animation and I'm going to show you my new build, my mage build. It's experimental, but I'm still going to do it for you. I will upload those videos today. Do it! And it will be this morning. I promise it will be bright and early for you guys, so you don't miss the video. Take it easy for me, all right? Bye. Just...